where sunscreen is the common name of an essay written as a potential commencement speech by Mary Schmick, and published in a June 1997 Chicago Tribune column titled Advice, Like Youth, Probably Just Wasted on the Young. The text, giving a series of general advice intended to live a happier life and avoid common frustrations, spread massively via viral email often erroneously attributed to author Kurt Vonnegut as an actual commencement speech he would have given at MIT. The essay became the basis for a successful spoken word song released in 1998 by Baz Luhrmann, Everybody's Free, also known as the Sunscreen Song. The song itself inspired numerous parodies. Chicago Tribune column, Mary Schmick's column advice, like youth, Probably Just Wasted on the Young was published in the Chicago Tribune on June 1, 1997. In the column's introduction, she presents the essay as the commencement speech she would give if she were asked to give one. In the speech, she insists on advising to wear sunscreen, and recites other likewise advice and warnings, intended to live a happier life and avoid common frustrations. She later explained that the initial inspiration for what advice to offer in it came from seeing a young woman sunbathing, and hoping that she was wearing sunscreen, unlike what she herself did at that age. The essay soon became the subject of an urban legend which said that it was an MIT commencement speech given by author Kurt Vonnegut. In truth, MIT's commencement speaker in 1997 was Kofi Annan and Vonnegut had never been the commencement speaker there. Despite a follow-up article by Schmick on August 3, 1997, the story became so widespread that Vonnegut's lawyer began receiving requests to reprint the speech. Vonnegut commented that he would have been proud had the words been his. Schmick published a short gift book adaption of the essay, Where Sunscreen, A Primer for Real Life, in 1998. The tenth anniversary edition was published in 2008. Baz Luhrmann version Track listing CD Marxy Capital 8,871,762 slash EAN 0724388817625, Everybody's Free, Everybody's Free, Love is in the Air performed by John Paul Young. The essay was used in its entirety by Australian film director Baz Luhrmann on his 1998 album Something for Everybody, as Everybody's Free. Also known as the Sunscreen Song. It sampled Le Mans' remixed version of the song Everybody's Free by Rosula, and opened with the words Ladies and Gentlemen of the Class of 99. It was later released as a single, in 1999. Le Mans explained that Anton Monstad, Josh Abrahams and he were working on the remix when Monstad received an email with a supposed Vonnegut speech. They decided to use it but were doubtful of getting through to Vonnegut for permission before their deadline, which was only one or two days away. While searching the internet for contact information they came upon the sunscreen controversy, and discovered that Schmick was the actual author. They emailed her and, with her permission, recorded the song the next day. The song features a spoken word track set over a mellow backing track. The Where Sunscreen speech is narrated by Australian voice actor Lee Perry. The backing is the choral version of Everybody's Free, a 1991 song by Rosula used in Le Mans film William Shakespeare's Romeo plus Juliet. The chorus, also from Everybody's Free, is sung by Condon Tava. The song was a top ten hit across Europe, but largely obscure in the U.S. until Aaron Schofield, a producer in Phoenix, Arizona, edited the original 12 inches version into a segment of a syndicated radio show called Modern Mix. This show played on many stations in the United States. In Portland, Oregon Euro, where Modern Mix played on KNRK Euro listeners began requesting the track. KNRK program director Mark Hamilton edited the song for time and began playing it regularly. He distributed the song to other program directors that he networked with and the song exploded in the U.S. The song reached number 45 on the Billboard's HOTA 100 in the United States, and number 1 in the United Kingdom and Ireland partly due to a media campaign by Radio 1 DJ Chris Moyles. It is played during the end credits in John Swanbeck's film The Big Cuyuna, starring Kevin Spacey, Danny DeVito and Peter Fascinelli. There are four versions of the song, the original 709 minutes mix from the album Baz Luhrmann Presents, Something for Everybody. 
1999 single release which features an 505 minute edit that lacks both choruses. Geographics Factor 15 Plus mix that runs for 442 minutes and a 2007 mix of the original 709 minute version released on the 10th anniversary edition of the William Shakespeare's Romeo Plus Juliet soundtrack on which the opening words are changed to Ladies and Gentlemen of the Class of 2007. There are two videos for the song, one which uses the 1999 505 minute single edit of the song, directed and animated by Bill Barminsky. And, Another a version using the 709 minute edit, made by the Brazilian advertising agency DM90DB. The song also appeared in Germany, and was soon followed by a German version with the title Sonnencream. The German translation is narrated by the German actor Dieter Brandke. There is also a Brazilian version which is narrated in Portuguese by Pedro Bial as well as a Swedish version, narrated by Rickard Wolf. A Russian adaptation of the song, recorded live by Silver Rain Radio, was performed by Alex Dubas and Yolka. On August 10, 2008, the song re-entered the UK singles chart at number 72. Parodies, the Baz Luhrmann song version inspired numerous parodies. John Safran released a song entitled Not the Sunscreen Song, which peaked at number 20 in Australia. American comedian Chris Rock enjoyed great success with his spoken word song No Sex, which was then subsequently parodied on Mad TV called Ain't No Blacks on the TV screen in the style of rock stand-up. The song was also parodied in an episode of Disney's House of Mouse performed by Jiminy Cricket. The comedy group Three Dead Trolls in a Baggy also made a parody entitled The Sunscreen Marketing Board. Jexy Dodd and the original Sinners version, Grumpy Old Men was voted favorite track of 2005 by BBC Radio 1 listeners in their annual Festivia 50 poll. Another parody by comedian Simi Arif was played on South African radio station East Coast Radio at the conclusion of the 2010 FIFA World Cup. Charts and Certifications, Bibliography, Where Sunscreen ISBN 0-8362-5528-3, References